Hi, this is Justice. In this video, I want to go over my uh, new process for taking notes inside of OneNote and uh, Bible study. So I'm using two apps. I'm using the Tablet Pro Studio app that has a new radio menu that looks like this. Um, this is great because I like actually holding my, my tablet vertically like a notebook as opposed to sideways like a computer. And so when this is um, sideways, actually I can close this panel over here on the left and maximize this out completely. And this is what I'm going to show you uh, this process. Okay, so uh, let's say I'm writing a few things and uh, we're going to have to adjust this because when this is gone, uh, the artist pad, this is going to scoot these over. So I'm going to make a couple quick adjustments. Uh, so what I did, opening up the studio app, choosing the word customize. Let's go to OneNote, customize. Okay, and we have these options here for the radio menu. Okay, so we're going to select right here. You can see this is the orange pencil. So we're going to drag to orange, red, we're going to drag to red. And we're not going to do this for all of these, just the click location ones. And hand tool. And let's see, we have, I think, just one more. No, that's it. Okay, then we're going to click update to radio menu. All right, so all of these should work now. Good. Okay, and we have one setting that we need to do here account, options, advanced, make sure automatically switch between inking, selecting, typing, and panning is unchecked. All right, now we are ready. Okay, so let's go here. We're going to write something and let's select it, ink to text. It works so amazingly well. Okay, and we're going to just handwrite something. We're going to leave this as it is. Now we're going to tap on this icon here. That's the pointer. Now we're going to talk so that we're doing input with our voice. We've done input from handwriting to text and we've done just handwriting. Okay, now let's input a Bible verse. So we're opening up Bible Verse Expander. The Windows keyboard shortcut for this is Control Alt Space. And so I'm going to select Joshua 1, 9, and 10. Now, in order to do this in the future, we may allow double click. Right now, you need to right click. So I selected the right click button right here. And then we're going to paste. So let's do that again. Let's go to Genesis 1, 1. You can just double click this, I'm going to tap here, press the side button on the stylus and press space. Okay, we're going to use the hand icon, pan up and over, write a few more things. And now let's select this and we're going to delete it. That's how I take Bible study notes. Uh, this is really how I take notes in general, but this works so well for me and I love that this is a big expansive note taking experience. It's not crowded, it's not busy, and just the stuff that I need and uh, not too much else. All right, in order to purchase the apps, uh, what you need to do is you need to go into the Microsoft Store. I'm going to go right here, type in Tablet Pro Studio. It's this very first one. Also find Bible Verse Expander. It's this one right here, very first option. And you can purchase and install that there. When you install the Studio app, it'll be right here. I think it's best to drag that down. Click on it once, it'll open it up and then you just double click on OneNote. Then when you're in OneNote, you can just use this radio menu nice and easily. All right, if you have questions, go ahead and put it in the comment section. Uh, you can join us in the Discord channel. Uh, if you're looking, if you have questions on how to use the app, there's tutorials right over here. 
the Discord channel. You can see the link right here. You click there and that'll open up Discord. And that's a great place to get your questions answered quickly. Or you can email me at justice at tabletpro.com. All right, you guys, thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video.